Hello everyone, I am Sekandar Abu Rakib. Please welcome to my tutorial. Today, I am going to show you how to create a script file and run a script file. So, before going to create a script file, I want to explain a bit why we need a script file. For example, if I run note that means I am going to check the version of node in a command prompt. So it is giving me the version. Similarly, npm minus v, I am checking the version of npm and I am going to check the version of git. So here I give three times three comment into the command line. What if I have a file where I can put all these comments and I will run a single file which will have these comments and automatically this comment will be executed sequentially. So exactly that the shell script does. So I am going to create a small project. I'm going to create shell script folder and switching to shell script. And I am within the shell script folder. Okay, so first of all, I am going to create the script file. So that I can do by using the touch command. With the script one and sh extension file extension A dot sh means shell script file. OK, now my file is empty, so I can say it. So file is empty. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to open my file into notepad and going to write my script. First of all, I am giving the name of this script with the comment hash sign. Then I am giving the clear comment that I applied into my command window here. For example, clear then I will write echo starting shell script then I would like to list the directory for that I am giving this command and then I can write npm minus v that means i'm going to check my version and then i can go for uh, before that i can write note minus v and then i can write github sorry git dash dash version and also I can check the composer which is a PHP package manager dependency manager composer version and I can write last echo ending of the script and last of all if I write cat this file s c r i t 
script one dot sh then it will show me the content of the file i'm going to save it and i'm going to command prompt and i am writing bash and script name dot sh full qualified file name then you see first starting the shell script that echoing out then uh, listing the directory that that means it is showing the script one sh file as we only have one file into this directory and version of node npm and git and the composer and then it is again echoing out ending of the script and the last of all it is showing the entire content of the script that we had written into our file so we can write our suitable comment into a script and we can run the script and by this way we can save time we can make faster our development process and there are another way of running this shell command that is instead of bash we can write sh and it will do the same and if you want to comment if you don't want to if you don't want not to run this line or execute this line you can make it comment by putting a hash sign in front of it and saving it and i can run script again so this is the sequence of the command that is executed by running the script file so this is all about the creating a shell script and running it i hope this small tutorial will be informative for you if you have any question please leave it in the comment and if you like the video tutorial please subscribe and thank you for watching